I'm Hannah from Stukin and Walsh and welcome to the virtual tour of 13 Haggard Place. This property is a four bedroom detached house located within the new Hawkrise development. So first of all, we're gonna take a quick look at the surrounding area. And as we pan round, you'll see we've got the fields at the end of this road here. So perfect for dog walks and getting the children out to stretch their legs. Um, but as you can see, the property is located within the new development close to amenities for Ledbury Town Centre, so very easy and walkable. But as you pan back round to the property, I'll let you know a little bit more about it. So we've got a large open plan living area downstairs, two bathrooms, and like I've said before, four bedrooms. We do also have plenty of parking and a garage. And so now that we've taken a look at the outside of the property, let's take a look inside. So we've now come through the front door to the property and first of all we enter into this nice spacious hallway so it's very light and bright and airy we do have the benefit of a window to the front there which helps to keep this space nice and light but the first room that we'll come into is the living area <clears throat> and as you come into here you'll really get a feel for the size of this room so perfect for families or large groups of people for entertaining because this space leads through to other social areas as well but you'll notice we've got that lovely bay window at the front lots of light flooding through here and we also have this open plan like I said before we've had the wall removed in here so it brings through into the dining area and as you'll see we've got the double doors open there leading perfectly out onto the garden and as you swing round, you'll see a bit of a sneak peek of the kitchen in the background there. So ideal for family parties, easy living, as there's no kind of blocks between rooms. Um, and you'll see how well this kitchen has been put together. We've got integrated appliances such as the fridge freezer, the dishwasher. We've got a five ring gas hob as well as electric ovens. And as you can see, we've got everything tying into place. So there's lovely dark green and wood in here as well. And that leads through into the um, space just off from the kitchen here. So perfect for your white goods. Um, but as you can see, it marries in with the kitchen itself. You've also got an access door to the side there, which takes you out to the parking and the garage of the property and the boilers in that room also. Just gonna have a proper look at this room, get a feel for that. And then as you lead back through into the hallway that we started in, I'll just show you the downstairs cloakroom. So you can see a nice spacious downstairs toilet. And then in a moment, we're just gonna head up these stairs onto the first floor and take a round, look around the bedrooms. So we've now come up the stairs onto the landing and we have a handy storage cupboard just here. And we also have access to the loft space as well. But first of all, we're gonna head into the master bedroom. And as you follow in, hopefully you'll get a real feel for the size of this, this bedroom. Very generous. We've got a window to the front of the property. And also the ensuite, so we've got a shower cubicle in there as well and so as we head out we will go into the next room along which is the third bedroom so currently used as a single bedroom but it is a good size we've got a window overlooking the garden of the property in this room And so heading back onto the landing, the next room that we will head into is the family bathroom. So we've got bath in here with shower over, low flush WC and sink there. Nice modern styling in this bathroom. And as we're gonna go round in order for the landing, the next door along is into bedroom number four. So as you can see at the moment, currently used as a wardrobe slash office space, but it's a good size single again with a window overlooking the garden. 
And I'm gonna let you go into bedroom number two, which you can see. Again, a generous size double, nice and light and airy. And so now that we've taken a look at the upstairs of the property, now let's go and have a look in the garden. So we've now come out of the double doors that led from the kitchen dining area onto a large lawned area of garden. And as you can see, we've got wooden fences all around. The garden does also have a side access gate, which takes you to the garage and the parking area. But as you'll be able to see, it's a large space to do what you want with it. You could leave it as lawn or you could develop it further. So that concludes the virtual tour of 13 Haggard Place. Thank you ever so much for watching and please don't hesitate to be in touch if you'd like some more information.